This is an emergency. Joshua the bear is missing. Search teams are on the lookout. The person who finds him will receive a red crayon and will be invited to join the aristocrat club. Red crayon aristocrats. <laughs> I have missed him. He's ever such a good dog. So we're back. Yes, it looks like we're on the dirigible once again. Equip our old sharps shovel. And of course, now we don't have any of the things I wanted to trade in. Well, we could see if we could get into the salon again, which should just be forward and all the way forward in the door on the right. Let's see. Unless, like I said, they've changed it from it being a safe room. Oh, there's uh, Elena. And, yes, and it's not a safe room. Yeah, they have changed it. The cold princess said. Ellipses. The thief will be punished. Oh. And also, yes, the bird is there. Oh. You chase it around the room. <laughs> Just goes back. Still lots of upended furniture. No more ties or ropes or cloths or... <gasps> That's off kilter though. <laughs> mm. Let's look around on this floor, see if we can find anything else. Otherwise we have no clue as to where to go. Other than, obviously, the uh, That would take we got. us out, outside as well, yeah. Sorry, I thought that was what you meant. <laughs> no, just the, the clue was that we have to... What was it? Find something? Joshua the Bear. Yes. A VIP room? He could be in here. Very important... something. Would have worked if it was VIB. This is from us completing the mermaid room story. It's like there could be something in the bed, but it doesn't show you it. Oh. Is that a mirror? I thought it was a vase or a vase. Either way, it just looks like it's um, decorative. It's so creaky. No more uh, cellists. Probably um, a good thing. The music can get a little much. Mm. Dressing room. When you opened the door, you were greeted with a wonderful scent. Yes, it was the fresh scent of the first snow of winter. A cool and crisp scent drifts around the room. Hmm. Or about the room, I should say. I've got a bucket and a bin. Poor helpless unlucky girl. Tell me your tale. Let's look at all of our items.
left, etc. I want. We'll try the socks as well. Oops, I want to pull it out instead of something. And also I'm going to pull that out because I suspect that the perfume is in the room. I think the cold spin was a tradable item, but we only have one anyway. Yeah, that's why I'm not pulling it out. Now, do we need to put anything away? I quite like the idea of being able to find Martha and Amanda, but I think Martha's gone, to mm. be honest. Let's just get rid of that. Whereas it mentioned Amanda. Yeah. Do I want to take any more food, or are we good as we are? We've got four scams, one shortbread, and one piece of candy. Yeah, we're probably all right for now. Brown can probably find more, actually. Oops, didn't mean to click on that. Let's see if this works. I don't even know if this is the one that finds winter or if we've missed some in between. That's interesting. It's finding something, but not in here. Oh dear, can you go to the end and see if you can move the camera out? I'm also clicking on things because I was wondering if maybe the scent is just somewhere. Yeah. No. I feel like if the game had had more time to be finished, there would be things like the mirrors where I would actually show you something different. Yeah, I'm not sure how unfinished or finished it actually was in the end. This is the end you've been at. It certainly feels rushed in places. Yeah, it feels like I could have done with a little bit more polishing. While still, to be fair, being a fairly complete game, you can play it, you can finish it. Like all the way through, yeah. It's like Vampire the Masquerade. Ooh. Probably not as bad, actually. Meg. The wise-looking princess said... The princess was very fond of Sir Joshua the Bear. So her highness is rather displeased by this incident. The culprit who stole Sir Joshua will be severely punished. I'm sure you have a punishment in mind, don't you, Meg? Get to use your find button. Go! Not in here then. I can always go back to the salon if I need to pick up the trail. Let's try the sick bay. We can go into the sick bay. Oh, it's been a while. You see, yes, it's all. Tied up with the effects of the uh, mermaid story, I'm assuming, is supposed to be the idea still. It's just a little cupboard wiggling. Oh, that scared the pants off Right? Me. <laughs> yeah. Let's see if we can uh, get around the tied up bit by going directly into the sick room. Yes, we can. The lonely princess is sleeping quietly. Traces of tears shimmer around her eyes. Do we have more of these? I think we only read the bottom left one about the gingerbread house. Well, and these two. Yeah. So we've seen this one. Yeah. Drawing of a boy and a girl. Hmm. Nobody can live at that speed. Same. Is that something on yeah, the ground there? Yeah, it looked like there was a note. It might just be left over from the previous part of the game. I don't think it's a note, I think it's those towels. Ah, oh, okay. No, it isn't those towels, it's towels are miles away. 
It's something else. I'm not sure what. It's also not there in that view. I think it is there in that view. I think it's just something that shouldn't be necessarily showing where it is. Ah, it's not important anyway. We can't interact with it. Either way. Both doors go to the library on the other side. Go! Oh. Really? Well, spring found summer. Summer perfume, the scent of a sunny day. That's the same again, because I hit the wrong button. But let's see if Brown can find the next one. Not me, we can't. Go. I'll try back in the middle. It seems to have a very short range. Specifically, go out of your way to find it, yeah. Back to the library. Honestly, didn't think I was going to find it this run, to be honest. I was expecting this to be in an extras run. This will be autumn? Oh, fall. Jennifer found fall. <laughs> yes, the season um, called that because leaves fall, presumably. I don't know. Is that true? Fall perfume. The soothing smell of autumn leaves. And then fall should find winter, which I assume is just in the dressing room. Go. What? What do you mean you can't find it now? It's down the corridor. It was five seconds ago, Papa. Um, the dressing room is opposite the VIP room. Oh, so it is. When you open the door, you were again greeted. <laughs> okay, we've seen that. <laughs> Find me the smell of winter. Jennifer found winter. Doesn't find anything. It does not. Winter perfume, the refreshing scent of winter's first snow, specifically. If it smells like the second snow, it's wrong. Bork, bork. So what are the perfumes for, or is it going to review it later? I'm assuming we put them in the box. Oh, right. Right? Maybe it'll give us a lot of mince pies. What door? I'm not seeing any door. Uh -huh. I've got no idea how to get in there. It'll be collect everything, probably. Are we going to tra trade some items then? Items, my dear. No, this isn't how I do it, is it? No, you have to be in the menu, yeah. Yeah, we don't have enough either way. Are you going for it anyway? Um, yeah, we might as well get rid of them. We have something to find more, don't we? 
I don't remember, to be honest. Well, hang on, let's have a quick check, because this will still tell us. We can find socks. That finds marbles. Oh. Have a perfume. Scent of spring, scent of summer, scent of fall, scent of winter. Ah, what a, bl a splendid blend of aromas. The air's scents have been united. Now, place them into my belly. What? You heard them. Is it just shorthand it for that one? Oh! You that's how we get in that room. secret room key. Now we can go in that room and find... What was it we were looking for? I don't know. And yes, that seemed to shorthand it, though we do still have all the marbles. No! Secret room that I accidentally found. It looks pretty obvious, to be fair. No, I mean, I deliberately, I didn't deliberately go for it. You have to actually use the key. First of all, we need to look at it, come to think of it. Admittedly, yes, you should. Secret room key. A key that unlocks the secret room. What an amazing description. Hidden hallway. And there, in fact, is our... Another marble. Marble, yeah. Go! And another marble. One more. We've got enough. What's that say? I'm oh. assuming Prince and Princess's quarters. I think it does, yes. Let's just ignore the obvious uh... Marble. So we've got enough now. Yes, it's a shabby little room with two chairs and a table with what is, is it a rope? a rope a gun and a box of some sort or a bit of paper maybe jennifer found a revolver about using the gun the gun can be used once you've equipped it on the menu screen and have bullets available hold the r1 button to ready the gun then press the x button to shoot You can also look at it, I suppose. Ooh, it's a fine target as well. Guess what it finds? It'll find bullets. Revolver. It can be used with the right bullets. Is that readable? It almost looks... It does look like it's a bit of paper or a newspaper or... Hmm. Well, you wouldn't be able to read it in the original resolution, certainly. And yes, it's certainly a grim tableau. Are we going to use the find bullets? So, find on the gun, I guess. Oh. It's got a bullet in it, I think. Go! Okay, can we find... You know, nice things? Not more marbles, please. What about any of these? Go. Yes. Suck, I think. Go. Back out we go. Footprints in the dusty floor. Hmm. Well, now you can't find anything. But yes, we could trade in more marbles. Do we get anything for trading in socks? I forget. I think so, yeah. I'm assuming we get uh, dog things. Because it seems like a dog thing, yeah? I guess. It's smelly. It tells you it's smelly, to be fair. Does it? Yeah. When you look at it. Is 
specifically confections. Yeah, I'm thinking um, we use sweets to find socks, so you can get rid of all of the socks. Oh, but they find scones. They're really useful. Then keep a sock if you wish, or not. Well, you've said it now. We need two more of those. We can find more socks, though, so it's not a big deal, big deal. We can probably drop that now, actually. Actually, go over the sweet. It's the marble that finds the sock. It's been, been repaired. repaired. Mm. Shortbread. It's worth it. Yes, so we could drop the key. Go! Yes, I swear as the game's gone on, he actually has a smaller range. So Candy can also find Candy. Go. Oh, Shortbread could also find socks, I didn't remember. There's a lot of crossover. Mm. I think we're done here though. Did we go into the salon? Mm, yes, yes, the girl was in there with the red bird. Yes, that's it's right. It's no longer a saver, an item room. And she's still there. I don't know if you want to save or you think you're all right. Oh, I'm probably good. Okay, let's explore. Have we really got no other clue, though? Tosh. You just gotta look around, I guess. Maybe Susan will help us. Why would someone steal something so precious to the princess? Why? Can we still go in here? Because that was a long time coming. Mm. Wonder what we've missed. Bound to be some rooms. But yes, this is where the goat fell out. Ooh. Jeez. But yes, look like it was like stuffed with rocks or something weird, or maybe it was supposed to be bits of paper. We do an old uh, brown find, yeah. Not in here though. Go! He's like, I'm going, I'm going. Yeah, it's still a very ridiculous way she says it. Go! I'm sure Joshua will like the story I wrote for him. Jennifer found a rag princess. Rag princess. Clearly Amanda. Once upon a time, there was a girl who sued rags. Sold rags. Day in, day out. The stench of the rags seeped into her clothes. 
Her stepsisters wore beautiful dresses and went to the ball. The girl stayed at home and her jealousy festered. One day, a fairy godmother came, cast a spell upon the girl and said, Sew yourself an ash grey dress. Then you can go to the ball like your stepsisters. The girl patched together the sooty rags and that's how she became the Rag Princess. A very stinky princess indeed. She stunk up the whole town in fact. No girl who stunk so much would be allowed into the ball. I'll make that girl wear this awful dress myself. And thus the Rag Princess and the girl in the rag dress became play pals. Mm -hmm. Actually, if we could go back to one of the... Oh yeah, the pictures were quite interesting, weren't they? It was... Oh, keep going one. And one more. Because I, th that, I think to me that's um, Meg in the back, Eleanor and Diana, maybe? Perhaps, yeah. It's difficult to tell from, obviously, those drawings. I can't tell if that's a frog. Obviously, those are all the little imps. Little imps, yeah. And the girl in the grey dress is presumably me. Or Jennifer, I should say. Yeah, because you and oh, Amanda... Oh yeah, because three princesses are stopping her. You and Amanda were always separate on the uh, the club listings. This is the sewing room, not the working class luggage. Dog's like, let me out. Hey! That's the bear! Is it? That's totally the bear! Hey! You can see it's a button eye sort of briefly for a frame. Right. Let's try that again. Hey! Like the last frame you can see the bear face. Small diary, floral pattern, glass case. Total wall. is locked of course. This horrifying thing. Something is covered up. And then I assume you can talk to Amanda or... She just shakes her head at us. You don't suspect me of stealing it, do you? I know who really took Joshua the bear. It's, um, Wendy. She's always sick in bed. It's got to be her. Sing. So it's almost like she's, um, trying to play the game that the other girls play. Yeah, but Where it's not... like, just blame someone else then. And it's like, it doesn't really work. No, and she can't do it particularly convincingly. Oh, these two guys are here. And the gluttonous prince said... The stick I was playing knight with broke in half. I wonder where I can find a good stick around here. The sloppy prince said... My sword broke while we were playing knights in shining armour. You don't have a nice stick we can use, do you? If I did, I would beat you around the face. I mean, you've got a shovel. Oh, 
last time we were here. Brown. People in here. Not this no, time. Which probably means we can go in. Yes, quite. Let's also try the aristocrat middle class luggage. <clears throat> yeah, I'm going to check that door title because that's where that says aristocrat. It does. I don't know if you'd noticed the whole time the one that says middle class luggage we went in and it was aristocrat luggage. So oh, they're like flipped. They reversed, right? Yeah. Brown. You okay, Brown? Come! Well, you need to do the thing so I can. Actually, I probably can't do it with a shovel in my hand anyway. No, I'm thinking you've got a two-handed weapon, yeah. We've got round the corner is the other room, the filth room. Has that gotten more ropes and stuff? I don't know, maybe. I don't think these were here before. I don't really remember, I'm afraid. They're all over the walls I as well. I don't think those were there, admittedly, yeah. What great detail. I really do dig how much stuff changes. Well, this room looks different again, I think, a little. Looks a little bit more run down to me, I don't know. I'm not sure the pictures of children were there last time. Maybe they were, it's hard to tell. Tied tightly with a rope. Which I think it said that last time. The good old bucket knight is here. Well, there is this key. It's a lollipop. It's a I lollipop. I keep on thinking they're keys as well. In a better world, there would just be lolly keys. <laughs> 